Hi guys, so today I am going to be doing something a little different because I usually do makeup, but I decided to order off of Sheen. It's a an app on my phone. So I can actually show you guys. Um, a lot of people just have been talking about it and so I thought I would do a review on the clothes because a lot of people have been wondering if it's a good app or not. So, whoa, you cannot see that at all. But right there is the app and when you click into it, it looks like this. So. 29 things and $217 that makes everything like 10 bucks so thought that was a pretty good deal and it's a heavy box and it's like overly stuffed but it's not that big which I thought 29 things would be bigger than this but not everything is huge I mean I got like some beauty blenders and stuff but I guess let's just break into this it's super thick tape they must have had to do that for everything to get closed in the box that's the only reason I'm opening it on camera is because I wanted to show you guys like how stuffed the box was I thought it was pretty crazy okay And I'll try these on for you guys too. It'll be in different lighting because I'm not going to try them on right now, but I'll edit them in as if I did. Okay, so the first thing feels like a purse. Yep. Which I was super excited about because it was only $19. looks smaller than I thought it would kind of disappointing I mean I don't know I guess it's an okay size it just looked bigger so so I think it's pretty nice still a little small for but I think I would rate this like a 6 out of 10, just it's not really my style. Next thing I have looks like a bralette. Oh, I'm struggling. Yep, and I think this was $7, so I think pretty good quality. I got one of these off a of Wish and it wasn't like this. It was like one strap up here and then one strap down here. It didn't have these two straps. So then it like bunched up really bad right here. But this looks like it'll be nice. So here's the bralette on with something I'd actually wear because it matches pretty nicely. I think it looks pretty good, even if it was on like this, still think it would look pretty good. Okay, so the next item came in a Ziploc bag, pretty high quality, just kidding. Ooh. I wanted to get this because I have a skirt that when I tuck in the shirt, you can see every wrinkle, so I thought if I got a bodysuit, you wouldn't be able to see every little wrinkle and it's like I thought it would be like a navy blue but it's kind of like I don't even know how to describe it but it's not navy blue it's like a brighter blue it has a turtleneck and then just a long sleeve which I don't know if the sleeves will fit me because my arms are super long so so with this one it fits I like that the arms are long and it's like a stretchier material so even if you weren't exactly a small, I think it would stretch to you. And it doesn't feel like super tight either. It feels nice. 
and I like it. I would. The material is really nice and comfortable. I would give it a 8 out of 10 just because it shows a little bit of where my bra is sitting and where my ribs are. So, Ooh, something sparkly. Nice. I got in a size small. Doesn't look to be see through at all. So, not even, well, maybe a little bit on the white, but that's natural. So, I'd rate this like a 9 out of 10 for the quality and the feel. I guess we'll see what it looks like on. With this one, I like it. I mean, it's a little short. Like, if I would lift up my arms, it's a little short. So with this, I would probably wear like some high rise leggings or something, pull them up here, and then it would just be like mostly legs in that outfit, which it usually is anyway because my legs are so long, but I like it. The pocket's a little high, but I think it's cute, so I'll give this a 10 out of 10. So now, another bodysuit it looks like, and this one I got with an open back. So this is the back of the shirt, and it's like completely open. I thought that would look cute, um, maybe with that skirt again. This one does look a little see-through, but it might just be because that light is so bright. So we'll try these on and, and hope that it's not see-through, but it's just another long sleeve, and it's like a maroon red. It looks like a red red on your screen, but it's more maroon. So this, I like that the arms are long, longer than the blue even. I like that the back is open. I think that's pretty cute. This one is a little bit more snug, and you can see a little more with this one, even my belly ring and my hip piercings, but I do like it. I would wear it with my skirt. It's it's a little more business casual, so it's comfortable and it's silky. I would give it probably an 8 out of 10, maybe a 7, just for how much it shows. Don't know if I'll ever wear it. I have to take all my piercings if I do, but overall... I like it, like the back, a lot. Alright, so these are some shorts, and they're high-waisted shorts, and they are fully sequins. Like, I thought these were just gorgeous on the woman that was wearing them. So, they have this little latch as the button, and then a tiny little zipper. Well, it's a pretty long zipper. Anyway, so I'll have to try these on. I'm excited, and they feel good quality. They're, like, a little heavy, but I think that they look good. And I don't know if they'll be too short for me because my legs are really long. But look at them shine. I like how that looks. I would rate these a 10 out of 10 just because I love them already. <laughs> And then I hate them, and yeah, no, I'm just kidding. I don't know what'll happen. Alright, so I like these shorts a lot. Um, they, good, they go good with this bodysuit, too. They are really tight-fitting, and I went back and I looked at what I ordered, and I guess I got these in an extra small on accident. Not that they're so tight-fitting, but if I was to eat a meal... I probably wouldn't be able to wear them anymore because the button would pop. Like, it's not like it's hard to breathe, but it's just, I don't know. They're not the most comfortable how they fit, and they're short, but, yeah, too short. So, maybe a small or a medium would have been better. I really do like these, though. Like, look at me. If I'm walking, I'll just be shimmering away. Like, these aren't itchy. You can't even feel them, like, when you walk like this. So, 
I really like them. They're just not true to size. So I guess 10 out of 10. Alright, this one looks like a dress. I did get a couple dresses just because I don't dress up ever. But I love buying them. I don't know why. I'm weird. Okay, so right off the bat, the sequins are breaking, but just in one spot. I'm just going to cut that off right away. There. Now you can't even tell. So I thought it came with two straps, but I was wrong. It comes with one. It's like a chain strap. I thought it was super cute. And then it does look pretty see-through. Maybe that's because I'm holding it up to the light. But yeah, even when I hold it up to that light. Hmm. Not really when I put my hand in it. A little bit though. So I mean, I don't know. Probably would have to wear a white bra. But... Did it just break? Okay, no. It just came undone. That scared me. It's like, well, zero out of ten. Just kidding. Okay, so. Oh, it does strap on both sides. Okay, so the back is open halfway, and then there's some length. There is a little. Another thing hanging. But I do think that. This will be super cute. So when I do look at the back, I can see the black tag through. I don't know. You guys could probably see it. But, um, so I think it might be pretty see-through and I'm kind of scared. But we'll see when we try it on. <laughs> so I was debating on showing you guys this one because it's a little showing and it's like super short so maybe I should have sized up with this I mean it fits well it just it's short and that's typical with how long my legs are I do like it though when I go like this it's itchy so I mean walking around in this all day might get itchy if your arms touch your sides a lot but I do like the open back I like the chain necklace thing, neck piece. Um, it's a little open for me, but I do like it. I would give it a, I don't know, 10 out of 10, I guess, for quality and stuff. I would like it to be longer, more like down here, but that's okay. Okay, so next I got some hair extensions just because I've been wanting them and these are the luxury volume ones and I've seen people get this brand and actually for five dollars I think this might actually be a good deal if okay it's not like I felt the people's hair that have had this brand I've seen it on YouTube so I don't know if they could have been lying about their rating on it but if they weren't I'm gonna Hope that they weren't, and then this be like a huge steal. They're in a net, so I can't really feel the quality. But they're long. That's what I wanted. So I'll probably try these on for you guys a day that I straighten my hair. Just so you guys can see, and I do have black underneath, so... I don't know where these would even fit in because they're all blonde, but they are like my natural blonde color hair. Like, I think they match pretty decently. And then I bought a hat with a flute on it because I've seen them at the store and they're like $15, but I got this one for 5 so... Having a hard time opening it. And I can't try it on for you guys. But it looks good quality. I like red. Some of these are difficult to open. Alright, this is a sports bra. 
love flirt peace I don't know that's what it says and then it's just this plain black sports bra you probably will not see this on me either so I got it in a small should fit it feels like I mean it's got a little bit of padding usually sports bras don't so I mean that's nice um, it feels like a nice stretchy material 8% something in a different language so <laughs> give it a 9 out of 10 for suspicion here's the sports bra on I think that it fits really well and it looks really good and there's padding so no need to wear like a bra underneath I think it looks nice and okay these I got for my dress I'm going to a wedding so um, for my backless outfit I got these nipple pads yeah I really just wanted to try them out I don't want to show you the front <laughs> it looks weird it's like a, there are boobs but anyway they're wearing these and it came with eight and it says they're reusable. So, oh, it came with 10. I can't count. But it says they're reusable. I guess they just stick on there. They're good for when you don't want to wear a bra. That's why I got those, just for my outfits. And then I got a phone case. It says nice. I got it because it's yellow. Because I love yellow. I mean, I guess we can, we can try it on my phone right now. Oops. Well, now you guys know where my stash is. I ruined my nail, but I got it. <laughs> Pretty nice. <laughs> Just kidding. Okay. Whatever. We'll keep that. Good quality. 10 out of 10. Pretty solid. I'm not going to open these, but these are for your nails. So, I can just... Oh, block the camera. Okay, turn off the light. So, these are... Like, you put them on your nail, and then you put on the design with a different nail polish. They're just basically stickers, and then you peel them off. And your nails will be done. Next thing I got, oh, a little kickstand for my phone. Kind of like a pop socket, which I have right on this one. But this one's just, okay, didn't come out. This one's just a lemon drop. Oh my goodness, lighting. Can't even show you. So it's a lemon. Pretty nice. And you basically just put your finger in it. And then it holds your phone, like, put on my ring finger. I'm married. Uh, just kidding, this is my right hand, and um, that would not be my ring. But I'm not putting it on a yellow case because why? And it would cover up my ice, and it would just be ice. Okay. But anyway, it goes on the back of your phone. You just peel off the red sticky, put it on. I'll find a case for that. Ooh, it's bigger than my pop socket. Okay, you can't even see the white one because it's white. Oh, there. It's just a little bit bigger. And then, I don't even know why, because I didn't even get lash glue, but these were $2, so I bought them. Just because I've been wearing magnetic eyelashes and I 
haven't been wearing them. I've been trying to buy them, like ones that actually don't break, but I've bought four pairs and every single one of them broke. So this is it. Fake eyelashes are back. I'm using it. Now I'm gonna go buy some lash glue and wear some fake lashes. Cause I got 10 pairs, five pairs, 10 eyelashes. So then I got some jewelry. I don't even know why. I just am obsessed with jewelry. I love it. I actually just went to icing yesterday with my sister because I love it. But this is the back of it. it. Has a little ball on it. I don't know how that works. Pretty weird. I don't want to break it. So I can't really take it off here. But it's a little rose. I got it in gold. Then, y'all know I do hair too, so I got some clips because they were only $2 for six, and that's like unheard of because they're usually like $6 for six. They're freaking expensive. So, had to get me some. Not that I need any, but you can always use some clips. Alright, looks like we're back to clothes. So this is a pair of pants, well, leggings. I got them in size small. Can't wait to try these on. I've been super excited because all my leggings are black and boring. So I'm excited for that. This is what they look like on. Really comfortable, nice fitting. Definitely a 10 out of 10 for these. This is probably a pair of leggings that are black because <laughs> you know I had to get those at all that's why I remembered to do the peeling and these have like some weird thing going on in the back what is that if that's supposed to go up my crack these are gonna be a 0 out of 10 because I can't believe that I can't believe they didn't show me this in the picture they just said it has a pocket so I bought it well, they look long enough, they're just black, they feel silky, 0 out of 10. So these ones actually surprised me, they fit really well and they feel really comfortable. Like I thought this material was super weird, but it feels like you're not wearing pants and I don't know if there's a better feeling than that, plus they have pockets on both sides. so. They're actually pretty big, a lot bigger than I thought. These are actually really cute. They're really high-waisted, which I don't usually like, but that's okay. I would say definitely a 9 out of 10, if not a 10 out of 10, because they surprised me, so. But I got a nice shirt, white, with the cheap sequins, but that's okay. So, I got this shirt. <clears throat> I think it'll be nice. I got it in size small. Look how long it is. It's supposed to go with leggings or like some nice jeans. I think it'll be really cute. And these don't touch you because it's so thick on the back side. So, it won't even be itchy. That dress is the only thing that I think will be itchy so far. This is really cute and I like it. And it did come in black, but I liked it better in white. I kept the black on under for this one just to see how see-through or if it was see-through. So it's pretty see-through, like you can even see my skin, which is okay because you can always wear a white bra and a white cami underneath. I do like it, it's shorter in the front and longer in the back, so it's good. With basically anything, dark jeans probably would look best. So I really like this and I have an interview on Tuesday and maybe this is what I'll wear. Fits really good, size small, a little wrinkly, it'll need to be washed, but overall I would say 9 out of 10 because of the see-through, but fits nice, feels good. 
Okay, so the next thing I have looks like the beauty blenders I got. Now, I've been ordering beauty blenders offline a lot, and I've probably spent the $20 on them that they are at the store because I can't seem to find a good quality beauty blender, but I didn't want to spend $20 at the store. I thought that was just ridiculous. If they were $20 for a beauty blender, yeah, it wasn't going to happen. So, I paid $3, so a dollar for each, and... Ooh, these are super squishy. Like the other ones, okay. I'm just gonna show you because I ordered these off of Wish and yeah, I don't know why. They were only a dollar for eight, so I don't even know why. Well, I didn't really expect good quality, but I didn't expect bad quality, but they're like super hard and they're tiny. Like, here's this one, here's this one or midget but it didn't really matter because it's kind of nice for under the eyes but it doesn't do anything because it's so hard even when I get it wet so anyway that's my rant I got eight of them I used one and three <laughs> but anyway I've been looking for good beauty blenders and these are super squishy I think I just found a good beauty blender not even that I need beauty blenders, but everybody uses them. And I just think that when I do use the brush under the eye, it gets streaky. So I think a beauty blender will help a lot. So I don't even put makeup under my eyes normally just because it gets streaky and I don't need it anyway. I usually just do like down here at the bottom of my face where my acne acts up. But it also came with this one. Um, it's for the powder. When people put powder on, they wipe it on with this because the flat edge. I like these. I'm excited to use these. And then I got this one, which I think you hold it right here and then dab on your full face of makeup. But I usually do my makeup with a brush, but I will definitely give these a try. They're cute. They're pink. I wish they were yellow, but they're nice, and they're big, and they're soft, so I'm happy about that. Um, I also did get some hair ties. So this one's silver. Great color. Gold. Even better color. For my blonde hair, or if I want to be fancy. And then they came with like a shimmery brown. For brown haired people which is not me but I do have some black and I could give these away but they feel like nice quality I just hope they're not like the other ones where you have to put them in hot water to stretch them back because that was always just like and they came in a cute container so that was nice oops <laughs> my light It's black. I could have got it in yellow, which I was tempted, but I was like, it looks, I don't know. It didn't look right in yellow. So it's kind of like a sweatery shirt. The sleeves seem short, but they won't go through. This is the inside of the shirt, so that'll be nice that they won't be itchy. This whole sleeve is sequins, and this one's not. I like it and I'm excited to try it on. It feels good quality. So with this one, I don't think it was supposed to be this short, but if I do roll up the sleeves, it doesn't look half bad, you know? I don't know. It is a little itchy right here. You can see that the stuff is peeping through. So. That's a negative. The length of the shirt, you can't see because I'm wearing black pants. But it's long, it's past my hips, so that's good. Good, it's pretty. I like it. So I would say eight out of ten. Oh. Next we have another shirt. And this one. 
bodysuit again. Yeah. I went a little crazy because I kept seeing ones that would go good with the skirt that I have. So, it's a striped bodysuit with, I like this, it's a cute little cross part. Doesn't look see-through. So that's good. Oops. I like it. And it feels good quality. Stretchy. So, for this bodysuit, I decided to put it on with the skirt that I bought it for. And I think it looks really good. If I were to go into work, put this on. I think it looks cute. And I like this little crisscross. If I can figure it out, maybe it's supposed to fold under like that. Yeah, that looks neater. Do that to this. I think it looks really cute. So, definitely 10 out of 10. It fits really nice. It feels really nice. And you know, I had to get a clothing item that was yellow. So, I got a crop top. And it says honey. How cute. The sleeves are rolled. I like it. Size small. I'm excited to try it on. Yeah. So. <laughs> 10 out of 10. Alright. Tell me you don't love this. Honey. I really like it. It's really short. So probably wouldn't leave the house. Maybe with some leggings. It might. Some high leggings. But I really like it a lot. It's yellow and makes me happy. It's a little bit see-through, but minor. Okay, this. Uh, there's three items. I'll just save the, the wedding dress for last. Okay. So this is another dress. Because, like I said... I wanted some dresses. I don't know why I like buying them. I don't ever wear them. But this is what it looks like. It has colorful sequin arms. Pink into purple into yellow, blue, red. I like a pink again. I don't know. So super cute. Has it on both arms. And then it's just black dress. It looks big. But I wanted it to be bigger. I don't like things that hug my body. So I just want to see if it's long enough. Ooh, looks like it'll be long enough. I do like this one. The arms are a little bit short. So if I were to go out and wear it comfortably, I'd probably roll them up like this. And that doesn't look very dressy, kind of. But the length is way too short like that's almost my butt cheeks yeah so I would probably have to give this well with quality I mean these aren't itching me so if you're shorter then I would give it a 9 out of 10 just because it's not the most comfortable fitting like I couldn't tell which was the back and which was the front and there's no tag and like usually it's like a little bit lower in the front, higher up in the back, but literally it's the same. I could not tell. So it's pretty uncomfortable um, just standing here, like moving this little bit. It rises up. So I don't know if that's just because of how short it is on me, but that's what it's doing. So 9 out of 10. If it fit me, I would wear it. But it doesn't, so probably give it away. But I do like how pretty it is and how sparkly it is. Alright, so the last two things I got, they go together. And they're for the wedding that's coming up. That's basically why I bought everything. I'm going to be sad if it's not good. Because this is what I bought for the wedding. This is what I'm wearing. So, I guess I'll show you the dress first, and then I'll show you the item. You guys can probably guess what it is. Did it just show in the camera? I can't get it out. 
Let me stuff them in there. Okay, got it. So, <clears throat> the big reveal. It's a dress. I'll find the front. Okay. Oh, it's sparkly. <laughs> and it's gold. That's right. I had to get yellow. So, the top is black. And the bottom is this gold. And it's a lot longer than I thought. I am so happy about that because usually things are too short for me. And I was just like, please be down closer to my knees. Like, I hate short stuff. And this looks like, like, look how long the skirt is. I don't know. I'm happy. I'm so happy about that. And it doesn't look like it'll be too big. I mean, maybe a little bit because it's supposed to be like a tight skirt but it doesn't look like it'll be too big like I think it'll fit maybe my waist will be the only part that might not fit because it's small but 10 out of 10 and then I got this with it I thought it was open and it's not all the way but whatever this beautiful now I totally forgot what they're called. Whatever. I can't remember, but I don't know how to open it. Like, do you press the ball? Okay, so I figured it out. You just lift it up a little bit. And then it opens, and it came with a chain! Which I wasn't sure if it was going to come with the chain or not, but I'm so happy that it did because otherwise I wasn't even going to use it. And I still can't remember what it's called. But it's just silver on the back, which is really nice because then when it's on me, it won't get like, these won't rub on me. These are beautiful. I'm like, get this light out of here. That is so pretty, I think. It's super cute. I'm excited about it. And it's like a good size. Just so sit at my hip. Hold whatever I want to bring. Probably nothing and I don't care because it was just for decoration. So I am going to put on the chain. Ooh, having trouble. But I got one side so. There we go. Like that so it's really nice with the chain I think it looks really good and it's like a good length on me I decided to put the whole outfit together for you guys got my bag got my dress got my jewelry so I really like how the clutch turned out painted my nails to match and I really love how this fits like it's not too tight and it's not too loose it's not too short it's definitely like look past my fingertips I was so happy about that um, so I got this jewelry it's one necklace even though it looks like two I think it's really cute I mean this is kind of tight so I'm not really sure if I wear it but I like it and then I got some earrings pretty cute and for the bracelet I got this but I'm not decided if I'm going to wear this or my charm bracelet. It'll probably be this because it matches this better. But I really do like the charm bracelet, so I'm not sure. Definitely 10 out of 10 with this outfit. 10 out of 10 with this bag. Big enough to store some snacks for the wedding, so happy about that. But thank you guys for watching. I really hope you liked the video. Comment down below if you did. And if you want to see more videos like this, thanks for watching.